experience with workshops, probably the main thing that I try to get is for it to be in the moment so that you actually work at connecting with your model and relaxing them, like getting them to be, not waiting for that camera click because as soon as you wait for that camera click, you're losing a lot of the impact of the photo. There was one setup that we did. We had the two rooms running today on two different levels, but one setup we had was with a friend of mine, Chris, modelling with another friend of mine, Lisa. So Lisa's meant to almost be an angel. She's just come in to, she's just flitted past you. It's very surreal. The scene was, it was to actually have Chris focused and sharp and the way we set our cameras up, we were having Lisa blurred and it was like a, initially the idea was just because it was a cool effect. And then when I set the scene up, it actually made so much sense to me that Chris was posed looking really hard and strong and protective. And I saw him as being a representation of where humanity's at, and especially where males are at. That we're so scared to show emotion, we're so scared to lose control. So Chris was very controlled in his pose. This is all going to be about different lighting techniques this room. So, but this is the first lighting technique. The further the light is from the mesh, the stronger the shadowing. Someone could even go and shoot over there if they think it looks good. Because you can, and then you can do body crops as well. Just be really free and creative with everything. That looks stunning. As soon as you did that, that is such a beautiful line. And don't rush through a scene. Really get the passion out of each scene. You get amazing lighting from over here. Oh, that's amazing, Laura. That's amazing. We want people to look at these shots of these beautiful women, even the people that judge nudity, and there's a lot out there that do. We want them to look at these girls and feel an energy in it where they, their judgment goes. Um, Tony kept popping down um, into the studio and we were working and you know as soon as he comes into the room everything changes like because he just guides them. Tony's really the only person that's ever um, taken photos of me and I think the only reason is because um, I, I do feel we have a connection as opposed to just strictly like this position, that position I think he sort of tries to bring out that energy. My passion is the nude and today was for a long time the first fully nude one we've done and, and I was really excited to share that with people and to try and bring my excitement across to the, the people that came to the workshop. I'm really hoping that the students get a feel for the beauty of women, like today's one being about women being the subjects. These women today were beautiful looking women but not many people in society are empowered by that and I think most of the people here, probably all of the people here, I reckon they actually enjoyed their time today. It wasn't it wasn't like a workshop, it was fun.